you all what's in here. Guarantee you, it's not coffee. We have this too. So welcome, I'm Tracy. This is my channel, Tracy from the Mermaid Cove. And my best friend's birthday is coming up. And, um, and there's those of you who are like us and are gonna understand. And then there's those of you who are just amused and those of you are gonna think you guys are just absolutely crazy. It's okay. We like to collect things, right? So buttons. Beverly and I could sit for hours and just play with buttons and organize them and, and then just throw them all back in a heap. It's a thing, right? Gosh, how do I drink out of this thing? Um, so what I do is, so this came off, so this is annoying. I'd like to get this one off. How easy was that? Actually, and then things can go on top of it. So this is what I would say, just yumminess. So I'm just going to start and show you. So these are like metal-ish type things, right? She's going to love this. I'm sure she has one. But this kind of thing she loves and she'll use it. I mean, I was thinking about putting on the cover of a book or, you know, all kinds of stuff. But she's going to love that. And these I'm keeping because she has some like it. Right? So I'm going to take my little basket and what is not going. She doesn't need these because she has plenty. Um, but what you're going to do is you can do little collages in them. And you can rust them in any way. I've gotten rid of so many. But, you know, a few are fine. And it's not as if, you know, I'm not going to have. So look at this, y'all. That's right. So it looks like there's some jewelry in there. Um, but like here, you never know. I just sweep things off my desk. So let's deep dive some of this, y'all. So again, there are just little things. Will I use them? I don't know. Y'all, it's not the point, is it? It's not the point. Um, just little weirdo things. And now, of course, what I'm going to task her with is sorting. So metal with metal, little jewelry bits with jewelry bits, right? And maybe she wants a button. So she can, um, these are little, she can enjoy that. And she can just put things in different things. She'll love it. This is the greatest gift, honest God. Um, look, I have that. This is a little um, bookmark. Learn from yesterday, live for today, and hope for tomorrow. I like kids, but I don't think I could eat a whole one. Okay. I don't know about that, but what I would do is put my own thing over there, and then you put like a, um, a resin or something. It's already got that on it. So this is some kind of Vanguard, I don't, you know little thing of screws, but I'm not gonna take too much out because she'll enjoy looking at it all, right? Whether she takes them or not. And there was, um, cats. There was um, a couple of people who worked for different departments in the county and he would, he would use metal and stuff or, and he would just sweep out his truck. So there's all kinds of stuff, so. This is, I don't think this is my actual grandmother's, but um, she had stuff like this, right? Anyway. Let's get ready to do my assemblage, y'all. These are just like, like, you know, technically these don't need to be in here, but it's more like a treasure trove, right? Than, you know. Um, look at that. At least the love watches, y'all. That's so funny. I bet it works if you get the battery change and a new thingy. Um, anyway, so that's enough of that. This one. So what I have to do is tape it up really well. 
really well, y'all. This can go in there because it's a piece of metal. Tin, basically. Okay. What would be better is have something clear. Um, so this, we went to this thing. It was called Artiology. Um, it was a weekend. I feel like it was in Atlantic City. I wish they'd put the date on there. But part of what you paid for, you got this thing. And it had all kinds of interesting things in it for class and, you know, like your past would have been in there, that kind of thing. Um, let's see. Okay, yes, I do have this taped because the lid does not stay on. And honestly, this, yeah. This is the one. Now, I know some of you are like, oh my God, just junk, junk, and junk. But those of you who think, oh my God, I could sit for hours, you know, and just go through this. I probably picked this up with her in mind. But I'd be really interested. This is real more truly um, metal stuff. You know? Um, these are from Bullets, I think. These are the ones that we're obsessed with. Now she's in the middle of decluttering, right? But this is, she doesn't have to keep one thing. She can just enjoy looking at it. This is a, oh y'all, we don't need to be that close. What's happening? So bulbs, yeah, for assemblage. Yeah, I'm not gonna take out too much. But, um, I'll be curious, to look at this like really old locket. I mean, you can totally use that in art. So it is fun and it's contained and I have many, many, many containers of stuff like this. I think we were taking a class on how you age metal quickly. Um, no idea. But again, it's just the joy she's gonna have. And even if she doesn't want to keep one thing, she better wear gloves or get a tetanus shot. Um, she's going to have, she's going to love it. After all, it is the thrill of the hunt. So, that is, um, and this was cut from a, from, I don't know, I guess, who knows. Um, these are sewing machine needles. I should keep that. So we're going to work on our sewing machine very soon. So I think this is the stuff that guy gave me. Just weird little stuff. He's like, are you sure you want it? I'm like, yeah, I do. I'm sure. Look at that. So anyway, I know y'all think, uh-huh, but no. I'm going to tape them up really good. And I just kept a few things I know she's not gonna really want. And she has some of these, y'all, you know. <sighs> these are window markers. Yeah, I'm feeling a little tired. My ADHD medicine is not doing what it should, but here's what I've accomplished. So I removed the big tree from my cats. It used to be my cats, but my cat, she doesn't really use it. I'm using it as storage. Okay, it is not attractive storage. So move it out in the living room for now and see if my roommate wants it. If not, then I will survey people and see who might want it. It's a nice tree. Now, so I thought, y'all, let me just whoop you around here. I hope you can see because I can't see what you're seeing. So I thought I would get a like a rolling cart for Clara's food, but I managed to get it all in a cupboard. So I'm gonna live with that for a while and see if that works. Because I don't need, yeah, you know, put it where my t Pyrex is because you know, I don't need all my Pyrex right there, right? And I had other places I could put some more of the plasticky things and get to with no problem. That's the good thing about, you know, and then I will be doing, like I said, seasonally decluttering. Like, have I used this in the last three months? Have I thought about using it? Um. But what I want to do is my um, recycling has always bothered me. I've never had like a good spot and kind of leaned against the tree. But I have an Ikea bag I use to take it out, throw it out, and bring it back. 
because it's a good size. So I don't want to do too much. But I thought maybe there is a container I can put that in or something, right? But I'm going to look around and see what recycling in the house options are. Under my sink's not an option, y'all. It's not. None of my other cupboards are an option at this particular moment in time. But I like the idea of just having it low and not much there. You know, so that is, yeah. So that's quite the accomplishment, but right now, and then um, I try to have a couple extra cat foods just in case, you know, catastrophe ever since the pandemic. Um, because a couple of the things that my mother would make me, I would have to go get cat food. I had to get like dishwasher soap, you know, bags or certain things that she just couldn't live without when she knew she didn't have them. So I always managed to keep up on that. So I asked you guys, this is Brandon Clark, I think, or Brendan Clark, anyway. So he must have been like a teen beat kind of thing because he was in um, some movies that I, I don't, the Merlin Wizarders, I don't remember them really. And, but he was in like Love Boat and I think he probably was in like guest stars and TV shows and stuff at the time. But yeah, so beautiful eyes, beautiful lips. Y'all, just Team Beat for sure. I wish I had all my Team Beat, Tiger Beat. Do I? Yes, I do. But it's okay that I don't, right? Anyway, I'm not sure how I'm going to edit all of this, but I've been very good about, I'm going to tape these really good and put them in a bag and put them in my car. So I think I will save her other gifts when I actually see her. And because she'll take these home and she's just going to love it. And um, what a great birthday gift. She can spread them out, like I said. If she wants to organize them and put them in little bags for me, she can. If not, I, you know, it's just one of these things. Like I said, I have many of these things. And I just, you know, it's just fun. Especially if you're having like a depression or, I don't know, you're you're in, anxious to come and sort all this for me. It really takes me out of my own head, my own space. But yeah, so I'm going to let them go. Let her enjoy the thrill of it. And she will be so gleeful. We, um, yeah, sometimes at work, we would bring buttons or I would bring buttons, new ones that she hadn't seen. I'd let her pick some out, but we would organize them and just play with them. I mean, you know, slide them on the table. Yep. It's nice to be easy, like a little baby with his foot. So, all right, guys, you take care. I'm going to get busy. It's 110 I have until about... Five o'clock till I have to hop in the shower and get ready for my a donut outing. So I'm very excited. So I'm trying to have just nothing but protein today. Get myself proteined up. But yeah, all right. And you take care. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. I feel like doing a little art. So a little prepping. I might do that. And then I got already stuff put away, all my tools put away, all that put away. So I got some more stuff to put away and I got to organize all my empties and that kind of thing. But y'all look at this. This is that component that guy gave me. Bill, his name. No idea, y'all. I feel like there's some assemblage in my future. I already have this thing what I'm going to do called paint with um, objects. So I'm going to do, I have a huge canvas. What I'm going to do is, I think what I'm going to do is collage it with blue paper, blue paint, uh, make some white cloud kind of thing, uh, maybe texture medium, I don't know. And then I'm gonna do a rainbow and it's gonna be a rainbow, like all yellow objects, right? My rainbow is gonna be my rainbow, so there's gonna be some pink in my rainbow. Yep, there's gonna be pink. Um, but yeah, I just, I can see myself doing that. So anything that remotely is attached to that, I keep for now. You know, um, but that will be fun to get out and start sorting. I can only tell you how much fun that will be for me. Okay. All right, guys, take care. And if you're new and you're still here, thank you. Subscribe. Let me know where you're from. I'd love to know where everybody's from and your name. Cause sometimes the names are, you know, have nothing to do. Like mine's pretty obvious, Tracy from the Mermaid Code, but sometimes people have like different things. I think YouTube has screwed up names somehow. I'm not sure. But anyway, you take care and I will be back with something somewhere doing something weird and ridiculous. <laughs>